Hey, Paul Akers here. I'm going to show you an amazing new product called the 11th Finger, developed by Brian Roach, a woodshop teacher in Quinter, Kansas. So we had a problem. The problem was he has all the students, and I used to be a woodshop teacher, so I totally relate to this. So his students would go to cut something on the table saw, and invariably they forget to use the push stick because the push stick was kind of set in the side over here, or you know, it just wasn't in a great location. It was somewhere, right? So he said, if we could make the push stick so that it's always in the perfect position by putting magnets on the bottom so that it's exactly where you need it so when you're cutting you grab it push it through and in a split second it goes back in the correct position then the likelihood of a students using the product would be much higher and as a result they would keep all ten of their fingers hence why we called it the eleventh finger it's the sacrificial finger there's no reason to be sacrificing your fingers for a push stick that costs ten bucks so we made a very cool push stick with two neodymium magnets integrated into the bottom of it right here and right here. Now when you get your product, it's going to have a little piece of tape on here and the tape is simply to hold the magnets in in shipping because if you were to get it near something metal like that, it's possible the magnet could come out. But all you have to do is simply take the magnet and it pulls right back in because this magnet is pulling against this magnet. So under normal conditions, it's always going to be perfect, but in shipping, it could come out. So we put a little piece of tape on there just to make sure it stays in. Once you get it, you just peel that tape off and you're good to go. And you can use this thing indefinitely and it'll work just perfect. So now I'm going to demonstrate how it works. So I'm going to demo the 11 finger right now on our SCMI sliding table saw. Now this is a little bit different table saw than most people have, but normally our guard's going to be sitting over here. I pushed it out of the way for this demonstration just so you can see how easy it is and how well it works. But one thing I want to point out just before I even go, at Basket we use all of our products and the reason we use them is because they work so well. And I, I thought it was funny when I walked up here to shoot this video how many products that we're using here. Number one, our safety glasses are right here. Our power head screw is put here in a metal screw to actually clip the safety glasses on so they're always right where you need them. We have our tape measures, we have our speed clip, we have our super mags right here, and we have our micro mag square right here to square the blade. All on one table saw, that many fast cap products, and now, of course, the new 11th finger, which is really awesome. So, first thing I'm going to do, obviously, is put on my safety glass and get my gun. Okay, so I'm turning down the volume a little bit here. I'm doing a quick voiceover, just kind of tell you what I'm doing. So, you know, you're up against your saw. You're about ready to make a, a cut where you potentially can get your finger too close to the blade. You need that push stick, but your 11th finger is positioned perfectly, exactly where it needs to be. You push your wood through safely, efficiently no issue whatsoever and you put it back exactly where it needs to go the next time you're ready to cut. So it's very effective and it really promotes safety more than anything else because it's so convenient and so lean and well thought out. Brian Roach you did a great job. You're going to love this product.